new DLC available. In the third and final part of Money for the Vultures, the journey concludes in a fan favorite location, the infamous Bandit Fortress Eagle's Nest. Brave the walls of Eagle's Nest with cunning and guile, carry out Hector's plan in all its crazy glory, and find out if Rosie will keep her word, or if she still has an ace up her sleeve. Yeah, we did all the challenges. Okay, that says exactly what I just read out. Okay. Deep in the deserts of New Mexico lies Eagle's Nest, an old Pueblo fortress whose real name nobody cares to remember. Over the years, the nest has become infamous as a hideout for bandits and outlaws. Assaults happen frequently, and the owner never stays the same for long. Guided by their map, the gang reach Eagle's Nest, where they hope to finally lay hands on Vincent DeVitt's money. Against their better judgement, they begin enacting Hector's very elaborate plan. Nobody ever did anything just for money. I'm starting to believe that myself. We've gone to quite some lengths to hunt down DeVitt's lost riches. Hidden vaults, treasure maps, and now a fortress in the desert. Even worse, I'm starting to enjoy the company. <laughs> Mother would be shocked. Anyway, here's hoping that the plan my dear old Hector came up with doesn't kill us all. <laughs> we use Bianca. Uh, this is Hector's plan. He ties himself to a tree. Why can't I be the one with a plan for once, amigo? I swear, this is the last time I'm gonna help that stupid ox. All right then. No ammo, no backup. No problem. It kind of sounds like no plan. Shit. Gotta make sure nobody's watching when I cut him loose. Be a lot easier without this damn suit. Why is Cooper wearing a suit? Wait. Why, why is Hector even tied up here? We didn't get caught at the end of the last one, did we? I can't, I can't remember the end of the last one. Okay, so he's going to see footprints, right? Huh? Whose tracks are those? an example of you okay that just hides somewhere
We do have ammo here though. But all right, so it looks like no one sees this guy at all. Thought you were gonna make trouble, huh, big guy? And that's a poncho, so he won't be going out after, um, tracks. That guy watches tracks, though. Don't worry. <laughs> We'll find your little friend. <laughs> we can use that to our advantage, though. Um, so this we have to kill this guy. Pretty sure this guy's. Who do we have yeah. here? Apparently, you need to throw, not walk and stab. Catch. <laughs> okay, so we want to get this guy <clears throat> now to see footprints. Problem is this guy up the top. Okay, so I actually think what we want to have happen is this. Some cover. But not like that. But that's pretty much it. These guys are walking around this way. We'll speed up time. Taking out his friend would be great. I don't think that guy ever Thought looks this way. I wonder if we need to be in the bush already here. I think we needed to have sprinted across. I got you. Don't you move. There's a moment there. then <laughs> tracks go away don't worry <laughs> all right where's the okay so we can't the map's not letting us go further up. Right, so we're isolated to these. There's 
to seven guys total. He's with a, a dude. Yeah, it's a lot of red. The, these missions, these the three DLC ones, have been absolutely packed. Almost like two or three missions of the base game. We also can't sneak in that door. You look kind of I'm going to try and sneak in the door just to see what happens with this sleeping dude. Don't yeah, he wakes up. Okay. So we've got three guys over here. Two of which are eyeing off each other. Right? And one guy who yeah, isn't really looking after this. anyone, but is being seen by that guy. You look kind of familiar. Ah, forget it. So I think with these guys, um, because they're gunmen, Oh, he's a poncho though but the gunman we should be able to get to move like we should be able to get him to come and check our tracks No, the okay. So there's three, th three basic type of enemies. I think the I don't know if they get any more differentiation. So you have gunmen, which are kind of sloppy. The ponchos, which are the next level, and they'll sort of have a bit better security where they won't go off their patrol or go looking for stuff. They'll man their posts, whereas the gunmen will walk around. And then you've got the long coats, and they're tougher. So you can't just take them out on top of the foot, but they'll. Also, they'll go looking for things like they sort of kind of like make it, kind of make their own rules. Just like they'll be like, "Oh, this is interesting," and hours. anyone following this guy will go. Like if he sees something, this gunman will go follow him. And it's harder to get a gunman to leave someone else. Like they will act the similar to any superior unit they're with. There's also female gunmen and ponchos who interact with some of the characters differently. Like Rosie can um, uh, interact with the males, uh, but not with the uh, Rosie. Is it Rosie? But not with the the female characters. And then he'll so he'll be he's intrigued by footsteps. Who left? Catch. <laughs> Family's just got home. Little dogs having a very high pitched whine. <laughs> I've also just noticed that my camera filter's got a black spot over. Um, the game instead of having a clear spot over the game <laughs> um <laughs> that's interesting yeah, that's where Cooper is. Hey, hey, it's okay. It's okay, Chili.
Okay. So, why is... <laughs> Demon Thorn, yeah. I'm confused. Is it in here? Aha! It's supposed to be an alpha mask, right? Okay, so that would be bad, but at least now we can see the game. I just have to do nothing. What's wrong, Pooper? I know what's happening. Aha. <laughs> okay, problem solved. Pants is just dumb. What's up, Pepper? Hey, I know you got food. You got food. Nailed it. All right. Yeah, so now you can see Cooper. All right, cool. All right, so now we should be able to take out this guy at the back because um, gunman there, he's not... These guys won't see him unless they walk over this way, which I don't think they do. So let's just go play knifey spoony. He's got the spoon, we've got the knife. Uh oh, uh oh. <clears throat> Koopa, Koopa, Koopa. Okay, apparently they do walk over there, so we just need to do it quicker. Leave the bodies there. I'm sure Hector can pick them up and, and get them later. Okay, now this is going to be important. We need to very quickly get this guy. While that guy's not watching him. Don't worry. <laughs> we'll find your little friend. It's going to be when he turns around, I think. Hey Solid, how you doing? You appreciate me appreciating you today? Oh, I appreciate you appreciating me appreciating you today. How close is it? What's going on? I think we I, I think we can um we can do that. We just can't pick up the body. Right? Or we go here with the body. You look 
look kind of familiar. Ah, forget it. Footprints go away. Footprints go away. Oh. Yo, Twig. How you doing, man? Okay, we're good, we're good. Alright, so we have... I We walked past the guy that way. I wonder if we can walk this way and in through the door before he wakes up. I don't think we can. However... We have access to um, to guns now. All right. So that gives us two bullets, which is the other question: is Does Hector have his axe? If Hector has his axe. Or what's really a thing? When we release Hector, will they consider him released? Because sometimes you just go, we go release him. He won't sit there and pretend to still be taken down. He'll be all ready to go. In which case, then we need him already. Oh, I wonder if we're throw. Oh, okay. So this could be the option. It could be we throw the knife. And I think we can take that guy down by a knife without waking him up. But it means we don't have our knife anymore. Which we might need to cut Hector loose. Will they notice if Hector just gets up and um, runs away, though? Burning questions. Don't worry. <laughs> we'll find your little friend. Right, now, if he's going to be looking this way, we need to wait for him to look the other way and then head over into the bush or we go around the back again they're going to come through here you look kind of familiar ah forget it We have three quick slave save slots, so we'll We're go release Hector and see what happens now. And we should be able to get Hector. The question is, can we release him? Over here. Damn it! We can be quiet. So, how's that plan of yours looking now? Got anything to say for yourself? Relax, amigo. Everything went just Hector's as Hector's got all his gear. Yeah, like hell it did. And why'd I have to wear this damn suit? Let's just go over there. I'll talk you through. Hell, hey, where is he? Let's light this up. Shit! We gotta find him! Okay, so they're looking for us. Time for the axe. Yeah, I got it. Now, as long as they don't come looking in any bushes, we can take this guy down. I'm in the mood for some chopping. You got it, amigo. Shit! We gotta find him! <clears throat> there goes another. Over there? No problem. Never seen hey. those prints before. Uh oh. Who's leaving a track here? Let's go. Coming your tracks. So easy. I'll find you, you know. Okay. Mm. And we can almost oh, get this is gonna be painful. Oh. Come out. Here, come giddy, out. Giddy, giddy. Oh man. We could almost have a play here. Show some balls. Who needs a haircut? Let's do this. Not on my watch, here, asshole. Giddy, giddy, giddy. Uh, I should have cut back on the whiskey. Oh man. Okay. Yep. Shit! We gotta find him! Oh, 
on my way. No, don't sneak up and do it. Oh, I needed that. Good enough. Um, Hector, can you finish this guy off, please? Can do. Time for the axe. <laughs> I live for this. Got plenty of room. So, so it turns out Hector had a plan, and that ended, which we didn't see, and that's what ended him up here. And so we rejoined the game um, after Hector's plan apparently worked. This way, amigo. Now let's feed some bodies to the bush because there's an achievement to get far too many people um, deposited in bushes, to act which I'm still working on. <laughs> there's also hot dogs for me. Tomato sauce was at that stage of the bottle where you've got to shake it down violently and then squeeze it and the bottle makes awful noises. That's okay though. Hiding people in bushes? Yeah, Assassin's Creed, Western style. Alright, where are we? Uh, I mean, be a little bit jealous because they're nice. They're only Ikea hot dogs, but I like Ikea hot dogs. Mmm, I see. All right, amigo. Listen up. The best part starts now. You're still trying to tell me this is all part of your plan? Of course it is. Just listen. Me and Rosie are pretty sure they keep the money in that tower. All we have to do is get in there, crack the lock on the door, and... Bingo. And how exactly are we going to crack the lock? That's the level you from De Desperado's one. You think it's they took Doc inside after they caught him? I think you should put off on that whiskey you have in your flask. <sighs> okay. So, Doc's in there. Fine. How are we supposed to get in there? We use the cannon. That thing? Who says it's even loaded? <laughs> There's a box of cannonballs right around here. We just gotta carry it to the cannon and boom. Great, but what about Kate and Isabel? Well, Isabel is up there. I think they're all still scared of her after that show she put on. And Kate is over there. I think the big guy has fallen in love with her. <laughs> Idiot. She better change out of that wedding dress, though. And that's about it. Open the gate, free dock, get into the tower, and hello retirement. And maybe free the others who are about to get killed because of you. Sure, maybe that too. Well, 
Serves him right. They even got swamp witches down in Baton Rouge. I am muted. <laughs> I was I was saying I, I don't think I can't remember if they used this map in Desperados three, but I hadn't played Desperados one yet, um, so I wouldn't have recognised it. Shady. And I don't think while playing Desperados one, I would have recognised it. Um. But this, I remember this. This was a whole pain. It was painful in Desperados one. And that's the gate where we put the snake bag and all the horses knocked off their riders and then we just walked up and stabbed them all. Oh man. Okay. Objectives. <clears throat> Hector's plan, part three. Part 3.5, part four. Okay, <clears throat> so we missed out on part one, but we had part two, which was free Hector. Um, cannonball crate, blow up Kate. Free Isabel and Kate and free McCoy is optional. <laughs> He's like, yeah, sure, whatever. We should probably do that. All right, so crate, cannonball. Okay. Kate's there. Where's the cannonball? Oh, the 3.5 optional comes first, I guess. So that's a marker here for the disguise to get Kate out of the wedding dress. Oh, and over the river we have... Why is this marked? Where's Isabel? Oh, that's the cannon. That's the there for probably the cannonballs. What about the big guy? He your loyal servant. Isabel's up Six. there, and there's the gate, and then we're moving in. Okay, so Kate the first, first right? Be here soon. That's a lot of red. Okay. So that's a long coat, which is a problem. Gunwoman, not so much a problem. Okay. Unless we want to go in here first and get Izzy first. Wow, that's a problem as well. This whole place is a problem. Going this way. Sure thing, amigo. Come on, amigo. I don't think they're using this uh, the cannonball here as an explosion. I think they're using it just as a projectile to damage the door.
Okay, so we can just walk around this one. I like it. Think I see Kate. I can't believe you talked her into proposing to that guy. <laughs> right? Rosie loved the idea too. Oh, I bet she did. That's why she's <laughs> okay. Can do. Think I see Kate. I can't oh, believe you talked to... her into proposing to that guy. <laughs> right? Rosie loved the idea too. Oh, I bet she did. That's why she's here right now, helping us. Relax, amigo. Here. I'm in the mood for some chopping. I ain't fooled some making a move. <clears throat> oh, I need that. This Wait is until nothing. you get to know the boys. They'll love you. That worked out really well. Definitely no complaints about that. Yeah, it's a, it's a great deal. Um, if you're still not sure, um, it plays very similarly to Blades of the Shogun. Same dev company, uh, just just slightly different IP. Very similar. They, I'm pretty sure they used their existing engine for that Don't and upgraded worry. it for the this. Um, and you can quite often get that. You know, when Steam sales go, that goes on really cheap. Um, if you're looking for gameplay. But yeah, I've I've, en I've enjoyed it thoroughly. We don't have any rings. But I'm sure that's all right with you. Is that guy out of range? I think he's out of sight of everyone there. Wait until you no. get to know the okay, boys. that one sees him occasionally. They'll so that's the you. next guy to come out. Oh, really? They can see him over that. No, okay, fair enough. Although we could get this gunman now. Since we managed to score that guy, let's get this gunman to walk around. What? Cover your tracks, asshole. Stop a cork in it. You didn't quite see him. Oof, oof. Okay, that's good. Taking that damn priest so long. Don't ask. Don't worry, the priest will be here soon. All right, who's next on the outside? They're kind of looking after each other. Sky. We don't have any rings, but I'm sure that's all right with you. All right, he walks away, so he's next. Except... He walks away as well. Wait until you get to know the boys. They'll this guy. You. So we can go for a distraction. 
Or we can... Oh, we have to take that guy out. Who's looking after this guy, though? Everyone's looking at this guy. Okay, we've got a, we've got a straggler. We can also grab any gunmen. They're all ponchos, though. Alright, we can come up the back way here. We might be able to get that guy on the way. Oh, Hector's got the whistle, though. house below us. There's ammo though if we want to go all guns and stuff. I wonder if the guy that comes around here to pee if he'll see us where we are. Maybe. I didn't save before throwing either. So long. Okay, we know that's that's the plan. Don't worry. The priest will be here soon. We can throw a coin to distract that guy as well. That'll give us our walk off. Where were we? Oh, we're about to knife this guy? That sounds fun. I think we can sit here behind this thing too, can't we? So we have to go right there. Did I not save it again? So long. Oh, good job, hands. <laughs> Pan save strikes again. Bwahaha 9000, you've arrived! Don't worry. The priest will be here soon. I got it, Tade.
I think that is the same deal. Like, we need to... I don't want to wait for him to come back, but I think this is going to be a plan here. We actually need to... You hear sure, that? Sure! Knock yourself out! I like that one. And now... <clears throat> we can go for Footprints or we can go for Hector. And I think having Hector here is not bad, right? But we could just... tracks of those ah. <gasps> objectives updated oh. Oh. <clears throat> so now we have um, okay we've got a gunman there we can grab don't worry the Maybe. <clears throat> I think what we want to do is wake up this gunman first. So that's a Hector deal. Making a move. I need a drink. <laughs> the rate at which the root systems right. of the plants absorb bodies would make you incredibly hesitant to hide in them. Get to know the boys. Hell. Yeah, yeah, I'm. I, yeah. Can do. On my way. Um. I wonder how quickly that guy's going to turn around. Like, can I lay Bianca here? Ready. Actually, what's the the sight on that guy? Okay, let's let's go. <clears throat> Almost ready. There. Time to make some noise. Not worth my time. Is this guy going to see him? More the merrier. Nope. Always trust in Bianca. This way, amigo. Bianca. I can do this all day. What? I got you. <clears throat> okay, he sees. Who goes there? Don't move an inch. Time to use Bianca. <clears throat> all set. To make some noise. Oh, hell, I need to... Let's do this. Hey, Stop a cork in I it. heard that. The more the merrier. Oh, he just. Is someone hiding in there? Don't move. <laughs> he, he just outright missed the trap. Sure thing, amigo. There she is. Looks like a job for Bianca. <clears throat> Almost ready. She's ready. I'll use my singing hey, voice. Not worth my time. Getting a bit crowded here. I heard that. Good girl. This way, amigo. Coming through. Oh man, he sees up there. So we have to try and get around this way. <clears throat> I'll use my singing voice. Hey, stop a cork in it. I think we can just sort of um. The more the merrier. Always trust in Bianca. I think we can just walk him down there. She looks ready. Coming through. Okay, hang on. <laughs> what sort of range does everyone else have here? 
Now we're good. Over there? No problem. This way, amigo. Let's lure someone in. You who? What's going on? What's going on? Time for the axe. I like it. Don't okay. move. <clears throat> we might have to time for the axe a little bit later. Am I playing with pause during showdown or not? No, on um, Desperado difficulty there is no pause on showdown. So generally, you only set up showdown one action per showdown, um, and then you leave showdown mode, and you either enact them all uh, individually, or you can set up one um, like with the different characters, uh, and they've got their own hotkeys, so that's Q or E, or you can enact the, enable all remaining ones. Uh, it'd be interesting to play on a on one of the lower difficulties and have the showdown thing because you can you can do an action and pause and then line up another one, so it's to compensate for not being able to you know mouse APM quick enough. Whereas if these guys are like John Wick level, he can you can throw the knife at him, pick it up, and then stab someone else and then throw it over that way. Uh, I don't know why they disabled that for the harder difficulty. I mean, it does make it harder, but it takes that sort of cool plan out of the game. Alright, Teed. Wait until you get to know you still the get boys. the standard showdown where you can preset you. moves up, which is pretty good. Okay, so we're going to need to kill this guy here. And I'm pretty sure no one sees him there. So if I just put the bear trap down... Time to use Bianca. Right, then we still let him from there. <laughs> Not worth my time. Yeah, He'll get up, walk it. into the in the trap. No one will see him. He's still got it. Mm. That sounds pretty good, Chris. This is nothing. <laughs> Alright, so this poncho is going to be one of the toughest ones now. That guy we can Don't worry. possibly the lure out. Be here soon. He's not seeing anything. It's only that one. He doesn't see down far enough, so we can lure this guy out now. Might be a Cooper thing. Need to do that, but without him seeing me. Um, so he just sees the footprints. How to go? Ugh, don't ask. Is that? Love. Did you not see the footprints? Did I not make footprints? There we go. Cover your tracks, asshole. Come on in. Who's leaving tracks? <laughs> you can be proud. You're marrying the strongest, most handsome man around. Poncho's not going to care about tracks. <clears throat> He's not going to see them anyway. Oh, that would work really well, Crit. Yeah. You can. Right, that's safe. Cook, right? Of course you can. <laughs> Look at you. So, this guy is pretty much fixated on Rosie. Sorry, Kate. Why do I keep calling her Rosie? Which one's Rosie? Oh, Rosie's um, What's taking um that Hector's the girl that's stringing Hector along. So it's only these two at each other. So we need to get Hector and um, Cooper to go for them now. Don't worry. 
The priest will be here soon. Alright, so it just depends who we want to line up where. And I don't think it matters who goes where. Alright, let's get Hector back around the other way then. Yeah, I got it. This way, amigo. Wait until you get to know the boys. They'll love you. Come on, amigo. I don't think... We'll have to wait and see if that guy... Um... Strongest, most... What is range? Oh, hang on. Alright, so he doesn't actually have vision inside here, except for where the dude is standing. So you we can, can get right behind. I'm in the mood for some chopping. What's taking that damn priest? I'm just gonna wait for that dude to come back around. The priest will be here soon. This one up here. We don't have any rings. <laughs> so right with me. Is that who the oh. fuck are you? Yeah. Okay, so he does actually see that you? part. The priest will be here soon. Why don't we stay where we are? Then we'll be fine. And then once he walks back the other way, we can deposit the body. We could probably even walk it. We don't have there. any rings, but I'm sure that's all right with you. <laughs> Wait until you get. Where do you want this? I love you. <laughs> I can handle it. Save. <laughs> Man around. Okay. These guys don't matter. At you this can point, cook, right? Sure thing, amigo. I don't think this guy ever looks at <clears throat> Kate. Right there, he does. Okay. What's taking that damn yeah, priest so it. long? Who needs a haircut? Hector. Damn it, what took you so long? <laughs> Sorry about that. You better cut me loose right now. All right, come to Hector. Over there? Oh, even better. No <clears throat> we don't have to, um... We don't have to get her out, so this guy won't even notice that the long coat's missing. Uh, whose tracks are those? Hey, Aurelian. Uh, this is the last know. mission of the DLC campaign. You're welcome. Hey! Hey, yeah. <laughs> oh, he's uh, on his own out here. I'm in the mood for some chopping. Let's do this. Yeah. Okay, they're down. I mean, 
there's no point. Like we've got to, we, we can't play favorites. We've got we have to take these guys, right? That's I think that's a rule. Yeah, so it's like, do you want to take the camp of no witnesses or the camp of leave someone to tell the story of what happened? I I'm a no witnesses kind of guy. Can do. Yeah, only one. That's fair. If we want to leave one. But if that's the case, like, we don't want it to be one of these guys. There might be someone better we can use. I like it. Time for the axe. Catch. <laughs> <laughs> this way, amigo. <laughs> this is nothing. The bushes. Got plenty of room. <laughs> oh, leave one after taking his eyes. Brutal. Okay, so we have Rosie. Kate. I keep calling her Rosie. Rosie's the uh, lady we think is going to turn on us. Remind me never to listen to one of your plans again. Come on, Kate. You did great. <laughs> that big guy even called the priest. Can someone please shut him up before I forget myself? Huh? What, what do they say? Let's just move on. <laughs> okay, so we need to get a... 